Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. Alon Paul here, and we're going to do a short video here today about the Guild Envoy. It's something that a lot of us have not been really touching, uh, touching too much on, but we've been discussing back and forth through different channels. And if a lot of you go into your exosuits and you take a look around, you might going to find something called a pirate transponder that you're getting now as you uh, take out some pirates and stuff like that. As you can see, I've got one in here, and I've got some other items as well. I just ignore those for now. But where do, what do you do with these transponders? If you highlight them again, let's go back in there one more time. You highlight them, it tells you that possession of such a device implies the destruction of the vessel in question. Turn it over to an envoy of the Mercenaries Guild to collect any associated bounties. So, where do we find those? Well, if we look at the guy behind us, this is one of those envoys. But, if you look very closely at the emblem above their head, no, that's not Bitcoin, that is the credit symbol that is used in No Man's Sky. So this is the... Uh, the guild, if you will, let me go into our settings here, not our mercenaries guild, which I've been working on, as you can see over here. Um, it is not that guild. It is the merchants guild, as you can see by the emblem on the left hand side. So what you're looking for is you're looking for a guild envoy that has one of these symbols, mercenary symbol, a shield and sword. You have an explorer's guild as well that'll have what looks like a compass, if you will. So we need to find a different envoy. So we can go to this guy though, if you want to build up your merchants guild a little bit, which I don't have any, um, uh, I think I don't have much of a standing at all with these guys and you can donate things like you can purchase stuff if you want but you can donate items like if I donate a storage augmentation which I've got a few in my inventory you can donate up to three a day and then you can redeem and it brings up your standing with them and you can start redeeming them for other things like I can get a warp hypercore out of this and purchase them again once a day so that's just in this station. I can find another station with a guild envoy for the merchants guild and I can get them there. So let's see. I'm going to go on to my next station and we're going to see what we can find in regards to... See, there you go. Guild rank has increased just by doing that. So as you get some of these items, you can uh, really get pretty far in these guilds a little bit quicker. So that's how this works. I'm going to get my new ship here. We're going to go on to another station and we're going to check it out real quick. We'll be right back as you see the transition fade in and out or the page turn. And we're back. So now we are approaching this space station here. Very cool looking station, of course, as usual. I like the yellows in here, along with a little bit of blue. It's kind of favorable towards those colors anyway. There we go. I don't know if it's blues. Uh, yeah, I guess it's blue. Hmm, interesting. Nice looking space station. So anyway, let's take a look up here, and it looks like we have finally found what we've been looking for. And that is the Mercenary Guild. Mercenary Guild is got the shield and sword, as you can see. Now, all you do is you come up to the Envoy. Once again, you donate, and you see I can donate a transponder. So I'm going to go ahead and donate that, and that's going to increase that. But you notice it'll take other things, too crystallized heart because I'm higher in the guild already I can donate a crystallized heart to them as well if I wish and you'll see you can only donate so many per day and some things it won't accept just yet you'll be able to ac accept these as you get higher up in your rankings but now that you've donated some things redeeming opens up more things so see now I can get some more if I wish uh, sometimes some upgrade modules uh, I see a Sentinel Boundary Map, Blaze Javelin, uh, S-Class Upgrade, and you'll get different upgrades from different places. So that could come in very handy. And in just a moment, you'll see my standing has increased by two. And there we go. And that's how this works, folks. And so that's where your Guild Envoy is. It's on the right-hand side of the uh, space station over on the right. And uh, this is how you trade up with the uh, Guild Envoys in order to get better rankings. Uh, in certain areas. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I was hoping it was informative to you. If so, please hit that like button and subscribe if you wish. Take care, everybody. We'll see you around real soon in the next video. Oop, got to wave. Bye, everybody. Yep, he's waving too. <laughs> Bye, everybody.